Hello guys, don't worry, double shots, and today I'm going to teach you how to play a game of pool. Now, pool is a tabletop game where there's 16 balls, but one of them, you're going to be shooting at it with a stick. And whoever gets most of their balls in, especially the eight ball last, will win. Now, before we go talk about that part, I'm going to break it down step by step, so that way you guys know how to get play this game. So, step number one, aim. I'd suggest use your thumb and your pointer finger. And the best way to do it, set it on the edge. I like to do it kind of sideways, so that way I can move it around a little bit. So that's one thing that you need to know. Or another way I like to do it, I like to do it this way, but I suggest do it this way. Next step, what ball are you going to be? So let's say I get a couple rounds. Let's say... Slow down ball. Let's say I hit a big group of balls. And I don't get anything. Then there'll be turns. Until... Watch what happens. Until... And so let's say I get a stripe in. Then I'm going to have to be stripes for now on. And let's say if I get all my stripes in. First before the other opponent. Then I can attempt for the 8 ball. But if I don't get the 8 ball in. Then I technically would not lose. I would still keep going until the other opponent gets all their balls in. So let's say they get all their balls in. And they're going to go for the eight ball. Let's say if they miss it. And they say, let's say they shoot it in. Technically, that would be a win for the other. But Here's a thing to it. If an opponent calls a pocket, let's say they're going to shoot it from here. And they call, let's say I feel confident hitting it in that pocket. So they'll say, I'll call that pocket. And let's say they don't get it or the ball is hit out, then technically that would be a loss for that player and a win for the other player. Almost makes it look like a quicker game, but technically you have to do it the right way than the wrong way. Let's say they don't call them, then they, then they just keep going. Let's say, let's say without using the stick as a model, let's say Somebody calls a pocket. They call that pocket. We're going to use that pocket again. And they shoot it at that angle, at that direction, and it actually goes in. Then they win. Then the other opponent loses. So, also, like I said back to the beginning about hitting the eight ball so that we can keep that in mind. If you call a pocket and you, you don't get it in, or this ball or the eight ball is out, you lose. But if you call the pocket, the right pocket, and you win, and you shoot it in, you win. So, let me set things up again. Sorry if it'll take me like a couple minutes to do this. I gotta get all balls in, and then I gotta really set it up. This is like a little bit of a racking part. This is like getting ready to start the game. Right. 
right. So let me bring the camera over here. For a second side where you guys can see. So, if you kind of put different balls in a different place, but here's a rule to it. You must put the eight ball in the middle. But if you're doing it one, two, three, four, fives, and so on, you'd have to put the ball right where this yellow solid ball is. So, like I said, if you're just mixing it all out, but you have to put the eight ball right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight ball all would be right here. So I know this was a short video, but so that way, let me break it down in the steps again to make it longer. Aim. Make sure you do it on the edge. Make sure you do kind of on the edge. Then we can get a good aim. The color that you're going to be. Again, if you're going to be solid, you're going to be solid. If you're going to be a stripe, you're going to be a stripe. Then, then, if you hit all of your balls in, you get to go for the eight ball. But if you get yours in first, then the other opponents, then you win. So maybe for a better breakdown, maybe in another kind of tutorial, I'll make like a part two. So that way you can kind of get like better detail. Maybe we'll do like a little competition, you know, kind of get a better detail. So that way you guys know how to play this game correctly. So hopefully you like it. If you like it, subscribe. And I guess I'll see you in the next video.